welcome back to my channel. I hope you all are doing well. So in today's video, I'm going to review the Nykaa Molten Matte Lipsticks. So these eight shades are the new launch in their existing Nykaa Molten Matte uh, range. And uh, I have all eight shades and I thought of uh, reviewing it for you guys. So uh, in total right now they have 20 shades and these are the eight new shades. The second launch has pretty amazing nudes and pinks as you can see. So they have a good combination of shades which will suit both uh, fair and dusky skin tones. So if you want to see the swatch and review of these lipsticks, uh, please stay tuned. So this is the outer packaging of uh, the lipstick. It is color coded like you can uh, see the shade in on the packaging itself and even the tube is color coded so if you have uh, many lipsticks uh, you can pick the shade which you want this is the actual size it is pretty um, decent size like it's pretty big so these are the lip and cheek color tints so you can use it on your lips and cheeks as well uh, this is the shade penny i'm wearing that on my lips and i've even applied it on my um, cheeks a little uh, so it's it was pretty easy to use and you can uh, you know uh, very easily match your blush and lipstick with these lipsticks the formula is amazing so uh, talking about the formula of this lipsticks, uh, it has a very moussey texture. So if you've used Lacme 925 lipsticks, uh, it's pretty similar to it. Like the formula is pretty similar. Uh, the formula is very lightweight. Like you don't even feel that you're wearing any lipstick on your lips. It's very comfortable and it's pretty moisturizing as well. Uh, these have dual application as I've mentioned. You can use it on your lips and cheeks. And uh, these are enriched with argan oil and uh, shea butter. So uh, that gives a very comfortable moisturized fe uh, feel to your lipsticks. Uh, the swatch is pretty glossy in the start. It will take around 10 minutes to fully dry matte. So uh, once it has uh, you know, settled, this is how it looks. Uh, the lasting power of these lipsticks are pretty uh, average. It will last for, you know, uh, four to five hours depending on um, your intake of food and uh, drinks uh, they fade quite evenly so it doesn't leave that patchy look once it starts to fade it fades pretty evenly uh, that's what I feel on my lips and you need to reapply it uh, after four to five hours depending uh, upon your need so let's see for transfer so it does have a slight uh, transfer like you can see the outline of the lip um, and I've worn this lipstick for uh, more than half an hour to 45 minutes to still it gives that uh, little outline of transfer uh, which is pretty decent like it is not a, a very transferable lipstick uh, so I think in this season when it's pretty humid and hot these lipsticks are very comfortable so it has a sheer to medium uh, coverage you can definitely build it up so you will not get full pigmentation in one swipe like uh, you need to uh, build it up you need to apply it uh, three four times to get uh, like high intensity color but if you just apply it two times you will get a pretty uh, decent coat like you can see on my lips uh, so yeah these lipsticks they retail for 525 rupees like the price point of the lipstick is really good it's uh, mid-ranged and according to the formula the pricing fits well uh, the formula is very nice as i said so if you're looking for a mozi matte lipstick uh, you can give nika uh, molten matte lipsticks a shot they are pretty good so i would rate them 8 on 10 so uh, yeah now i'll swatch these lipsticks for you so yeah, this is Lily and it's a beautiful dusky pink nude color. It looks uh, pretty. I think it looks pretty on me. I really like the shade as well. Uh, this will again suit more skin tones and it's beautiful. So this one is Veronica. It's a burnt pink color. Uh, like a very deep burnt pink color. Personally, I'm not a fan of this kind of pink on my uh, lips, but yeah, it's a beautiful color nevertheless. So, next. 
next shade we have is Mitch. It's a beautiful rouge uh, pink. Uh, I really like it's this kind of pink. Like it looks uh, pretty nice. I think so. According to me, this will suit a uh, fair to medium skin tone. peachy color but it is um, pretty light for uh, medium skin tones and I think it's a little patchy as well so next shade I have here is Robin this is a beautiful brown nude I uh, kind of like it it looks nice I think the shade suits me well and, it will, and I think it will look good on fair and dusky skin tones as well. With fair it will be like a proper brown colour and uh, for dusky skin tones it will be a beautiful nude. Uh, so yeah that's how it looks. The formula is pretty impressive when I'm uh, swatching so many lipsticks. After three to four lipsticks, my lips are dead and dry, but these are very comfortable, very easy to remove as well. Like I just take a cotton pad, some bioderma, I have some food cocktail, and it just comes out so easily. Like it's really very comfortable on the lips. So yeah, that's our pass. So the last shade from this range is Cheryl. It's a pink tone red. And um, that's how it looks, not a big fan of the shade. Subscribe to my channel and give this video a big thumbs up. I will see you guys in my next video.